NimbleStream or server playlist allows combining multiple media sources into a single live output. And this tutorial will make a live stream from a VOD file, an NDI live stream and RTMP ingest. Notice that this feature requires live transcoder to operate. We have a pre-installed NimbleStreamer instance with transcoder add-on installed. It also has an active license with proper subscription. First, we're going to set up an NDI input. We'll use a test pattern from NDI SDK. In order to process the input, we'll make a transcoder scenario. We have a separate tutorial video about NDI setup. Check the link in the description. Here we get an NDI source, add it into transcoding scenario and define an output. We can see the output successfully available. Let's test it via HLS stream. Now the input will be an RTMP stream with a tuning table and a timer generated by FFmpeg. It uses predefined RTMP settings, so once the stream is published, it can be seen in output streams. Let's test it via HLS. Now we're going to use Server Playlist Generator. This is a web page where you can construct your playlist using a simple interface. First, we define the name of the resulting output stream. One playlist allows defining unlimited number of output streams. There must be at least one block in the output stream, so we add it. We set it to loop and also to start at a particular point in time. Please check the playlist grammar description to see how it will work. We add a source with our RTMP stream by its output stream name. Then we add another source with NDI stream by its output name. All streams will be played for 180 seconds each. The third source is a VOD file. We use its local full path and name on our server. Once we've completed, we click on Show Playlist to see the result. Now let's save this config in a file to use further. We add this file path in a parameter at nimble config. Then let's restart Nimble in order to apply changes. Once we get back to the panel and check the Nimble output streams, we can see the resulting playlist live stream there. Let's use the HLS output from our resulting stream to check how it works. As the stream has been started from a point in the past, we see the third source being played right now. It's the big bug bunny from the VOD file. Now the bunny clip is over. Since the block is looped, it starts from the beginning. As you can see from the config, now it's time for the RTMP source. The first source shows the clock and the turning table for the next three minutes. We'll now skip most of this clip for our video tutorial. Now the first source for our playlist is over and it's time for the second source to step in. It's the NDI sample pattern defined by the corresponding element of the playlist config. Please find the link to full feature spec and other related materials in the description.